For years, I've thought that what I saw was just a bad dream. Something that couldn't possibly have been real. Why would it? Monstrous beings coming to get a helpless child from the shadows, poking their heads out from under the bed, peeking through the closet. Just a usual nightmare for a kid, right? No matter how real it felt. Well, most of what came after is foggy. Felt more like a dream than the actual nightmare itself. Um, Mom came to rescue me. Picked me up and carried me away. I was scared for my life. It was the scariest moment of my life, for sure. I've never been a crybaby, though. Even when I was a kid, people have told me they've never seen me cry, or yell, or even scream. So even if I was terrified during all of it, I would have been silent the entire time. But that was the strangest thing about that night. Even though I never made a peep, as I was being taken outside by my mother, away from the nightmare, I still vividly remember hearing my own screams. Nick? Nick! Fuck. What is happening? This isn't real. This isn't real. This isn't real. I'm just dreaming. None of this is real. Huh? are around the house. Here's your trusty flashlight to slay them with. We hide from the monsters. They were weak to mommy. So we hid where you always tell us to hide. Much love, Nick, Sam, and Anthony. Hmm. ever coming up. I'm not crazy. Well, whatever has brought them here must have done this too. I, I I don't know how much time has passed. I just know that I can't leave. They're waiting for me outside. Only here is safe. I, I, um, I, I've left these messages. <laughs> Help me remember what they do, how they act. I mean, I, I can do it, just... Oh, okay. Okay, uh, I'm using an old camera system I installed for fun in the house a long time ago. I've only managed to recover three of the cameras so far, but this is more than enough. I can watch the animatronics coming near me with these. Three monitors, three entrances. They haven't come in a while, but I know they'll be back soon. They become impatient, louder, faster. Especially, um, especially Foxy. Uh, Foxy, yeah, he's, uh, he's the one who's been tormenting me the most. Uh, I don't know where he comes from. 
comes from. I, I don't know how, but he just appears near an entrance. I can hear him coming. He growls and scrapes at the door. I, I just watch him through the cameras, and he eventually goes away. So I need to look at him in the monitors. I, uh, I, I guess he doesn't like being watched, huh? <laughs> Here, I, I can see him. He's not like the others. He just stands there. He knows he can't get to me. He's just waiting. I don't understand, but, but I know he isn't giving up. And I want to get out of here. And I just know it. He's the key to this. God, I, just, I, just, I can't stay put here. I need to fight for my family. Oh, God, they must be so scared. Gone. Okay. I have a flashlight ready with me. This might be suicide, but I need to try. If I see Freddy again, I'll just open up the door and flash his eyes. As soon as he's there, yes, I can't let him hold me down like this forever. I just hope this works out. If, if it doesn't, then I... Oh, honey, kids, if you are hearing this, I love you. Be safe. appeared again. The stain on the wall came back, too. God, I don't know. It's just so horrifying. She just wriggles and writhes back and forth, trying to get out of there. I, I know how to stop her, though. Whenever she shows up, her cupcake, I, I mean cupcakes, just, just appear in my room. Or next to my room. I've seen them outside sometimes. Uh, anyway, they, they just appear. And if I flash them with the light,
broke it. The bastard broke the camera. Damn it. I, Bonnie just broke one of my cameras. I, I, I don't know what happened. He just appeared, and as soon as I realized he was there, he just took it down and one swing. They don't do that. None of them. with my flashlight. Yep.